<laughs> Go ahead. It don't matter. <laughs> All right, guys. You ain't seen him in a while. There he is, Turbo Two Valve. Um, Want to share a couple cars we got to uh, Dino this week. Uh, the first one you're gonna see right here in the video is kind of unique. It was different. Don't a really, little different. A little different. You don't. They're out there. Uh, you don't see them a lot. Not really. Not common around here. But um, a little hint. It likes RPM. That was the second one. Oh, the wrong video. Yeah, okay. no, 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 they're both they're both gonna be in this video. Okay, one of them likes RPM. One of them likes RPM, but the first one was they're around, but they're not really what you say common around here. Yeah, uh, you can search on the internet and you find them several other places, but uh, very I thought it was very unique. Um, of course, uh, this, this this is for all the Mustang guys anyway, so that's why I got a Mustang guy with me. <laughs> uh, hey, you still liking yours? Still love mine. Whipple Coyote. Of course. For the win. For the win. But, uh, yeah, the second one in this video, that's the one that wanted all the RPMs. Yeah. So we'll just kind of leave it at that and hope y'all enjoy the video. All right, guys, we got something just a little bit different here. For a dyno tune today. <sighs> D1SC on it. But it's the 3.7. It's a so far it's making pretty good power. Nice little setup on it. Drive in here, tune it on it. Automatic car. We'll get you a run on it here in a minute. Gotta get the America in there. Anyway, guys, we're here with Kagan. Uh, I guess that's uh, who's that guy in the background? Ah, either way, it don't matter. All right, we got Kagan here with his 2016 Mustang. Uh, he's in for a dyno tune. We're gonna let him uh, tell you whatever he wants to tell you about it, and we're gonna start spinning the rollers and see what it makes, and come back to him and see his final thoughts. Uh, clearly, you know it's 2016 GT, uh, full bolt on car. Cams, oil pump gears, long tubes, coarse exhaust. Uh, so far, stock suspension, uh, other than BMR springs, cradle lockout. Uh, still MT82. Yeah, still MT82. Got a shifter though. Got to get yeah. that MGW in there. Yeah, got to make sure that. That's, there's something about that stick shift life though. Uh, it, is. Way. it really is. It's way more fun. Uh, uh, Porter cover jet, you know, whole nine yards. Yeah, it's a beautiful car. We'll, uh, like I said, we'll get it rolling on a dyno here. And I, and I, and I know you told Robbie there, said, hey, man, we're going to turn some RPMs with this thing. So, yeah, we're ever out to eight grand. There we go. So, let's see what we can get it doing at eight grand. And we'll this guy right here do his magic.
was an 8,000 RPM pull. Yeah, we got this one done off the dyno. I noticed some lights he had on the car, so I just wanted to walk around and check him out. Pretty good looking on the car. I'll check him out on Instagram right there. Look at it right there, we the people. Something I really like you don't see in a lot of these here is right there. And we'll go a little further. Down in the hood there. So we'll get with the owner right here and get his final thoughts and uh, see if he has anything planned later on for this car and whatever he wants to let us know. All right, Kagan, we uh, got you tuned there and everything. And uh, any final thoughts you want to give on it? Or Robbie did great. Can't wait to see what the car does on the street and the strip. Uh, later on down the road, we're clearly going to boost it. Just a matter of time. You ain't decided where you want turbo or? Not quite yet. We'll quite see where the road takes us. But yeah, it, it turned out good. And that man, I think it was screaming on the dyno. Yeah. She, she you said you wanted all 8,000 RPM, <laughs> so you got it. Uh, appreciate it. You guys be looking for this car. I think you go in the Mustang week. Yeah. So be he'll be there at Mustang Weeks. So I'll be looking for this one. And we look forward to uh, seeing what he does in the future.